Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your daily journal message for Tuesday, April 30th, 2024. Please keep in mind that this is a journal reading, so if you are interested in your own private reading, all that information uh, is down below in the description box below. Also, take the time to smash that like button and share, copy, or yeah, share and uh, comment down below. So let's get into it here. Yes, we are going live. Uh, around 6.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time tonight. I literally feel, why, uh, how much longer do I have to wait? Uh, but yeah, it's a tough time here, I feel, for somebody that is going through a waiting cycle. Uh, this, this too shall pass. My mom used to say that. Uh, but yeah, definitely there's going to be communication with two pages looking right at each other. The page of wands, the page of cups here for that uh, fulfillment of love with that ten of cups. I feel that your partner could be water sign energy, does not have to be, but they truly do love you. And I feel that they're going to show that I literally heard the initiative here. Fire sign energy with that king of wands. But regardless, goodness gracious, you got the king of pentacles right after that. Uh, the Queen of Swords, the Five of Wands, and the Tower. So as long it, somebody's out there thinking, as long as they love me, they show that initiative, and they're balanced, I can I can cut through the battle here of the past here, meaning that you can forgive them here. Okay, uh, that's for just you know whoever resonates with that, obviously. Uh, but I feel that you're going to hear them out, and they are going to communicate with the outcome cards being the Ace of Swords, the Four of Pentacles, and the Five of Cups. They do want that change. You do too, okay, for whomever this is meant for. And the Four of Pentacles is kind of staying quiet, but with that Ace of Swords right before it, they're going to break free of that quietness, meaning they're going to speak the truth here, show that initiative, just like it says here. So let's do the above and below here. Uh, the Queen of Cups, the World, and the King of Wands. So don't give up hope, okay, in regards to this is done. Use your intuition. Very similar message for yesterday's spread as well. Uh, but I feel that they are going to be returning and showing that drive, okay, that passion into this. Uh, so a little frustrated that you have not heard from them, but when they return, they will be balanced with the Nine of Wands, the Page of Wands, and the King of Pentacles present. With the Three of Wands, the, uh, the Page of Cups here, speaked of, uh, and the Queen of Swords, you're willing to listen to them. You can see a future once they, once they get rolling here with their communication skills. Things can be resolved here, okay? But it's going to be a battle initially, I feel. But the completion is one of fulfillment of love with that Wheel of Fortune, the Ten of Cups, and the Five of Wands. With the Ace of Wands... Uh, the King of Cups and the Tower, there could be a makeup session, if you know what I mean. Chemistry rebuilding here. I do feel it's going to come out of the blue. They're going to kind of get more and more aggressive here in getting this fulfillment here. Okay, not just on a chemistry level, I feel, with that Ace of Wands and the King of Cups here, but in general as well in regards to a relationship building. So, like I said, with the outcome cards being the Ace of Swords, the Four of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, fives are known for changes in regards to cup energy, which is love. Things are about to change. Things are going to open up more. Now, see the King of Cups, he's cool. Uh, you do have the power couple of the King and Queen of Cups here, so that's good. You two are meant to be together, I feel, but he tends to hold within, especially with emotions and communicating that factor uh, into this relationship. So things like that are going to change here. They're going to open up more, even more so with that Ace of Swords and the Four of Pentacles. So that is what I have. Uh, I can't remember if I said the time for the live, but it's going to be at 630 tonight. Eastern Standard Time. If you have any questions for the live, you can prepay ahead of time, absolutely, uh, and then we're going to answer them live. The only ones I cannot answer, disclaimer, are in regards to either law or health. I cannot legally answer those types of questions. So they are $7 per question, $22 for a full spread. I really get into the nitty gritty on both extremes. Uh, but definitely check it on out. Just even come on in and pop in and say hello if you wish. So 
no obligation, you know, to, to have to get a question. If you just want to say hi, please do. And I'll hopefully I'll see you then. Bye, guys.